Hello, <clears throat> everyone. This is Hook. Welcome to a demo of the altars. Yes, the altars are antlers. Now what? I'll just say altars. This is the demo, and let's do this. Like they do it on Discovery Channel. Resource management, survival, base building. I believe. Oh, coffee. How did I end up here? My whole life. All its ups and downs led me to this place. Far from home, far from anyone I know. A journey whose route is unknown. The destination out of sight. Was this path just a random sequence of events? that I had to follow? Or was there ever another way? Now, heading for the unknown, I can't really tell. Is this the end of the road? Or is it yet another branching? Emergency flare from my capsule. I should look out for those. There's no jumping. Or at least it's not long yet. I have an exoskeleton. Hello? Can you read me? This is Jan Dolsky. I've landed safely, but I think my capsule went astray. Ah, maybe the radio's broken. I gotta, gotta find the other 
Jesus. Intact. Uh, looks like she died inside of it. I don't get it. Okay, there's radiation ship on the wall screen and a battery symbol. The mobile base. There it is. Dolsky here. Anyone copy? If you can hear me, I've located the base. I'm gonna try and get down there. Well, maybe they landed closer to the drop-off point. I gotta keep moving. Capsules. Wait. Wait. What? No. That's impossible. They can't all be. Are they dead, but you're not? But why? It makes no sense. wave? Now? Oh shit, it's rising fast. I gotta get to the base. Yes, the elevator. Quick. Come on. Come on. Oh, that was close. Hello? Anybody here? <sighs> For a moment, I hope someone else made it. I need to find the comms room and get help. Hello? Hello, can anyone hear me? Mayday! Mayday, anyone?
Great. Um, yeah, uh, this is the new captain of the mission speaking, Jan Dolsky. Corporate ID 4672B. I'm afraid the former captain is gone. Together with the rest of the crew. Hello? Can you get me out of here? You're in imminent danger. We need more time remaining to survive. What do you mean? Remaining to what? Please. Talk to me! What's the danger? The planet is rising. You soon are in danger. Be lethal proxy. There's an instruction to the laws. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't you go all fuzzy on me. Lethal proximity. Oh, useless quantum nav system. Where the hell did it send us? Lethal proximity of what? Please, we can get a real force dark approaching. This battle, we must escape. The proximity dark days. You mean you mean a a star will come and, and burn this planet? And I and I just have days to escape? Is that right? Affirmative. Oh, sunrise. Ah, sunrise. Perfect. I need to find those captain's logs.
that shiny rock might be a source of metals. Looks like our ship's cargo drop. It's filled with the crew's personal items, including my stuff. Yeah, this is one of the things they told me to take on the mission. Things that will make you feel comfortable far away from home. Objects that trigger good memories. Typical corporate bullshit. It was dead, so I'm not sure what that was. Out. Hey,
Could this be... Rapidium? I feel strange. I have to get closer. Make sure. I need to collect a sample. So the useless quantum nav system isn't that useless after all. It knew where it was sending us. Except... Only I survived. No smoke. I should look for organics here. Still, can't believe it. If it really is Rapidium, this could change everything. I need to report it.
Hello? Anyone copy? I went out to find resources, and I found a cave full of something. I think it might be... Rapidium. You hear me? I think I found Rapidium. You sure about it? What? I... I'm sure. Yeah, I mean... What else could it be? Test it. Test the Rapidium? How would I do that? New blueprint provided. The womb. A blueprint? The womb. You want me to build a womb? Some DNA provided. This is fucked up, but what the hell? At least I got your attention. DNA sample, huh? I guess it makes sense. Rubidium speeds up organic growth. Outpost command center, I think. Here goes, in a sample, pitium. <laughs> I'm starting to worry this wasn't such a good idea. <laughs> oh. oh, oh, of course, <laughs> what else? <laughs> oh, no, you need a name. I think I'm going to call you... Molly. Okay, I built the womb and uh, tested the rapidium. The DNA sample provided was a little surprising, but it worked, I think. 
I cloned a sheep. Hello? Can you hear me? I, I have a sheep on board. You're responsible for two lives now. Go. Successful. Really found what did this. Yes, sir. Yes. Yeah, I did. It's fantastic, isn't it? I just have to get out of this alive to claim my medal. You're in imminent danger. Only oh, for time remaining to summarize. Thanks for reminding me. This is the kitchen.
expect that, but okay. Hello, Molly. Oh, you don't bite, do you? No, command center was down below. Whoa! 
what just happened? Come on. Don't do this to me now. Okay, that's sorted. Let's give it another go. I've got to be kidding me. Just my luck to be stuck in a junkyard! Hey, you still there? I really need your help. I can't get out of here. I did everything according to the manual, but there's a malfunction I can't fix. I just don't know how. Rapidium, Xavier. I need to check data consistently. See if you Only the captain has access codes to the quantum computer. Alright. Man, that was easy. Alright. <clears throat> One up. What is this? Mine records. What's going on? Recognize this. It's my life.
excuses, excuses. Did they get it and what for? Well, that's yeah, you screwed up big time. Hey, I checked the quantum computer. What do you want with it? Branching? What exactly will be branching? What is this on you? What? You what? Is that your whole answer? <laughs> Alter? I alter what? My life? Okay. You mean as in... Okay, wait a minute. You're not suggesting I... use Rapidium to create a... someone. And to alter their mind. That's uh, not what you're saying, right? Damn. All right, how about my other options? You jerk. I don't have other options, do I? That's... That's fucked up. Where? Up, not down. is about Wow, that's... He doesn't meet his girlfriend that way, though. Wait, that's the...
That is just... Stupid. Hey, hey there. Uh, wow. Um, hello. Hello? Can can you hear me? Uh, I, uh, what is this? Where am I? You're in a lab inside the SIBA unit. Your memories might be a bit fuzzy, but relax. You're gonna be okay. Yeah. Recognize the base. I think. Wait. You look funny. You... Ha ha. Oh. What was that? I wanted to laugh, but I'm like... indifferent. I think you're on some meds. What? What for? It's so you don't panic when you wake up. Why would I panic? I'll... I'll explain later. Right now, let's check your mental condition, okay? Do you think you can, uh, introduce yourself? Sure. Can you? Okay. Uh, my name is Jan Dolsky. <laughs> yeah, sure. You got my looks, why not use my name too? So you think you're Jan Dolsky as well? well? What kind of bullshit is this? Hmm? What's your role on the mission? I'm a senior technician. Want to tell me what your role is? Imitating human crew members? Is this some kind of sick experiment? Because if it is, nobody warned me. It's not an experiment. This is for real. And I'm for real. So, what's going on? Well, I got stranded in this base, and, um, well, I needed someone to help me move it. Because it got broken. 
then, okay, this is the crazy part. I learned that there's this functionality of the quantum computer on board to, uh, well, create alternate versions of a person's life. What? Replicate a person, but with different experiences. Mind records. <laughs> if there's anyone in a bad mental condition in this room, it's definitely not me. The QC's only functionality is to navigate these junkets. I mean, theoretically, it could do other stuff, but such bullshit? I know. It's absurd. I thought the same, but here you are, right? Right. If I understand you correctly, you're telling me you're a alternate version of me with a different mind? Uh, sort of, yeah. And, uh, you said we were stranded. Yes. It's just us. Like I said, there's a malfunction in the machinery. If you don't help me fix it soon, we're both gonna die. So, wait. Let me get this straight. This is not an experiment, and you're a different version of me. And this version of me woke me from cryosleep to help fix a malfunction because there's no one else on board. What if there was no malfunction? Where would I be? You'd still exist somewhere? Theoretically, at least? Theoretically? Ugh. Wow. You bastard. <clears throat> I can see now what the meds are for. I can't even lash out at you. Just this passive. I sure want the little choice. My bad. What am I? Look. This is a lot, and we'll sort it out. I promise. But trust me, if we don't fix the machinery fast, we're gonna go in a very bad way, and you'll never get the chance to understand this properly. Experience your feelings without the meds. <clears throat> yeah, I don't like this kind of pressure. Well, that makes two of us. Fine. Oh god, I still never Show had my way. Really. God damn it. Unbelievable. What a screw up. A three year old would have figured it out. Okay. In any other case, I'd say don't touch anything here ever again. But unfortunately, this is a two man job. On my sign, pull that lever over there. Just don't yank it like an idiot. Pull it gently. Ready? One, two, three, now. Yes! <laughs> it worked! You did it. We're gonna live. Let's get one thing straight. I did what you created me for. Now stay away from me.
pristine. I never thought I'd be so glad to see a sheep. Hey there. I said, don't come near me. I get it. You're angry. I, I would be too. But I could really use your help. You know, if we manage to get the comms room running properly, we'd probably be able to get out of here faster. Stop pretending you have any idea how I feel. I don't give a damn about your comms room. We're moving, aren't we? Now get out of my face, creep. You're pissed off at me now, but deep down, we both know you do the same thing. Really? You said it yourself. We might look alike, but we're different. Like oil and water, if you ask me, and they don't mix well. Maybe. But you won't last long without me, just as I couldn't make it without you. In a situation like this, hiding in a trench is just plain stupid. I'll tell you why it's stupid. Listening to someone who created you, because he needs a fucking tool. Why don't you get yourself a repair kit and fix your own shit? I'm done doing your dirty work. All right. Well, that was... Hello? Uh... Mr. Dalski? Yeah, yes, I'm, I'm, I'm here. 
Are you okay? Are you serious? I just had a choice to either die in pain or duplicate and edit myself. I'm far from okay. It's, uh, called branching. The duplicating and editing thing. I need to know if you pulled it off. Really? And I need to know who I'm talking to. I didn't catch your name. Oh, Lucas Pena, Space Traffic Control, Orbital Substation L7. Now, the branching. Did you do it? You left me no choice. Doesn't mean I like what I did. Is this even legal? You found Rapidium, Mr. Dolsky. We needed to act. What the hell happened out there? What went wrong with the landing? Uh, to be honest, I don't know. I'm still analyzing telemetry data from your flight, but it seems something went very wrong. No shit. <laughs> no kidding. Yeah. We know there was a major system malfunction, but the reasons are unclear. It's too early to tell. We need more data. Do you know what killed the rest of the crew? Looks like an oxygen leak in the landing pods. No idea why, though. Then how come I survived? You tell me. You know, you're not very informative. I don't like confusing assumptions with information, Mr. Dolsky. Conclusive evidence is more my thing. What about the mind records? Hmm? What is all that personal data doing in the base computer? Oh, that's, um, uh, the, the corporation needs to ensure the safety of the mission and, uh, basically everyone. It's confidential, of course. And it kind of saved your life. So, you're getting me out of here, right? You know how to do it. Safely. Sure. First thing I'll need you to do is to transport the base to a safe and accessible destination. I'll dispatch the coordinates to you. Uh, second thing... Do you think I could see this... altar of yours? How do you know you're not talking to him right now? You're... joking, right? Who knows? Yeah. <laughs> nice try, but I'd know the difference. The emo's oppressant meds, he wouldn't be in a disposition to mess around. How bad is he feeling? He's pissed off at me, won't cooperate. Then we have a problem. You won't manage without his help. The base needs more hands on deck. There should be a way to gain his trust. Sh show him you care, maybe? I told him I wouldn't survive without him. Yeah, that's just words. Maybe you should share something. What? Why? I don't know. Just a thought. <laughs> oh, my grandma used to say, sharing is caring. Bullshit. Yay. Let me think. What can I share with him? My playlist? Yeah, true. Wait, suppose it's not about what you can share with him. But what you already do. Of course. Memories. I wonder if he remembers things the same way I do. Yeah. Mind records. See? You were so spooked by them, they could be a source of information. Fine. I'll check them out, see what happens. Shit, I, uh, gotta go now. Urgent call. I'll get back to you as soon as you reach your destination. Don't worry, you're in good hands. <laughs> L7 out. <laughs> oh, bullshit. Thank <laughs> you.
kitchen. I've been thinking... You're right. Sure we are. Like, I got that right away? I'm serious. You stood up to Dad. I didn't. Oh, really? And what did you do? Just stand and watch him take it out on Mom? I thought about stepping in. I was always a, a heartbeat away from doing it, but when it came down to it, I'd just freeze. Guess I was afraid of making things worse. Yeah, I remember the feeling. But then I reached a breaking point. Looks like you didn't hang around long enough to reach yours. Or... Maybe I was a coward. Going to college was a good excuse to just get away from it all. Oh, so that's where our paths split. Did you shine out there? Were you best in class? What do you think? Huh? Yeah. The build around this merry-go-round. That's who I ended up being. Sorry to disappoint. Why would I be disappointed? Just proves I was right to stick with Mom. Wait, is Mom... Is she maybe still around, here? No. I wish she was. She always knew what to do. And how to cheer you up. Hey. When you were down, or... Dad had just stormed out of the house, slamming the door behind him and leaving you crying in your room... Would she ask me to help her make pierogi? Her famous... Oh my god, I could... And making them together was fun. I no way we'd find the ingredients here. Why not? We got a decent supply. Yeah. Hilary, if you die, I die. Why not? Won't you... Dolsky Pierogi with an interstellar twist. What do you think? Oh. <clears throat> now I know how Mom must have felt. That day she had a terrible flu and I decided to cheer her up and make pierogi for her. Right. Yeah. I put like a ton of salt into the filling. And I overcooked them into a shapeless pulp. They were inedible. But you remember what she did? Uh-huh. She ate them all and never said a word. No, no, she said they were delicious. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. So? They're delicious, man. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. Ah, oh, there's no save button. Oh man. Oh. So, so. Are we cool now? Cool. You mu Now you're being mean. I want you made an but see. That makes it even worse. It would be easier to hate you. But so did I. 
Are you getting mushy with me? What? No. Okay. Okay. Just kidding. I know what you mean. I'm just... not the sentimental type. Who's being sentimental? All I said... <sighs> the corporation is supposedly on top of this, but I know better than to... Oh, I hear ya. Right. So, until the rescue ship... Do they know about me? They were the ones who told... Bastards. Tell me you know what to do. All I know is we need to get to a safe place. Well, there's one thing you should know. This base is a resource-consuming, maintenance-heavy sucker to operate. I have you to help me. I'll be blunt with you. If you want to survive... People. The Rapidium's there. Use it. Versions of us both, you mean. Huh. <laughs> that almost sounded... You need to work on your cooking skills, though. I was hoping I could avoid going through all that again. Struggle. Are you... real? More real than you, I'm afraid. Boy, the... Oh, so, where's the captain? I told you, everyone died. Oh, this is insane, what a trip. Not a trip. It's reality. Your new reality. Are, are we brothers or something? We have the same DNA, but we led separate lives. What the hell? Calm down. You're not the original Jan, but that doesn't mean you can't be important. Well, you look like me, but also not like me. What the fuck did you drug me with, man? No. You're not hallucinating. Damn. Remember who you are. My name is Jan Dolsky, but I'm seeing fucking double. You should worry about that. Damn, that's a real. Ooh. That is. Oh, wow. There would definitely be a replay value in this. Just... Wow, that's... I don't know about this game, though. I mean, it def definitely has my attention, but... Wow. Alright. Leave a comment if you made it this far. Thank you if you did like share subscribe the whole youtube deal stay safe all and until next time